bow with Earthkind, and this video is about chinch bugs. If you have St. Augustine lawn, you really need to watch this video, especially if it's in the sun. St. Augustine can be damaged very quickly by chinch bugs. If you have an area that starts turning brown and it's in the heat of summer, definitely need to check for chinch bugs. They can be controlled if they're caught early and the damage will be minimal. If it's caught late, they can kill large sections of St. Augustine. In my own lawn, I had them last year. The area was about four feet by four feet. We caught the damage early, treated for them. They killed all the grass in that area. However, we put down compost and I put down fescue seed in the fall, given some time. Now this year, the St. Augustine's all returned on its own, it filled in. This may or may not work for you, but if it's not totally brown, St. Augustine can recover. So watch the video, be sure to like our YouTube channel, and I hope it gives you some useful tips on chinch bugs. Chinch bugs in North Texas can severely damage a St. Augustine lawn in summer. Here we see some chinch bug damage. It's August here in Texas, so it's over 100. Um, this area, you can see the brown area, that's chinch bugs. If you look closer at the grass, um, you can actually see chinch bug activity as they run. We usually see them in full sun, but sometimes they can be in the shade. Uh, so keep an eye out, you'll see them moving extremely fast. So up close, you can see chinch bugs fairly easily. Pick a spot that's uh, marginal, like part green, part brown and you should be able to see them like in the video uh, just running around very quickly on the leaf blades and then you'll know without doubt that in the St. Augustine it is chinch bugs. As you can see you can see them running around. Pick a hot part of the day that's when they're really active. So chinch bugs if it's suspected and you see them really need to be treated because they will spread very quickly. You don't want to fertilize, definitely don't put a high nitrogen fertilizer. It's best to go ahead and use an insecticide because they damage the lawn so quickly. And if you notice here, it'll spread from here to there within a matter of days. So if you use an insecticide, uh, synthetic, we would prefer organic. Uh, usually those kill uh, a lot of insects that are not selective but uh, that would be best to go ahead and treat them and stop further damage so in the same lawn another area uh, they had put some diatomaceous earth down that's the white powder and that worked in that area um, where they didn't put it actually the chinch bugs continued to damage the lawn um, Right here, as you see, it's really been damaged. Um, in between though, right, right there is damaged right there, it's starting to dry out. That's because they're aggressively starting on that area and then further out, it's still green. There's another house that has chinch bug damage. It was let go a little too long. So they're still active in here because there's still some green St. Augustine. Over here though, all that St. Augustine was damaged by chinch bugs. Um, if it's caught early and it's treated, it won't spread so fast, but this whole area probably only took maybe a week or two for the chinch bugs to progress.